Howdy. Welcome back to Final Liberation. It has been some amount of time, uh, which was necessary. It saves us from having another game design interlude. I can file that away to uh, perhaps the end of the series. Or at least some point in the future, which is not right now. I let me refamiliarize myself with the game. So, last time we had the situation that happened here. Yeah, we sure did. We have a new regiment now. Space Marine Detachment, two Predator Squadrons, and a Warlord Titan. I can't use them this turn, though. We just got them. I'm probably moving the 9th Basilisk Regiment up. And... Probably transferring out units here at the end of this turn so that I can attack with this regiment next turn. Though, who knows? Maybe just attacking with these two uh, Imperial Guard Tactical Plateau. So Alright. I gotta make sure I don't wind myself up. Let's, uh, let's look here to the north, yes? Shall we? We have an empty slot here. And uh, I think I'm gonna slot the Hellhounds right in. I'm uh, pretty interested in using uh, the regiment we liberated from the capital, from Pachinka's incompetent hands. We've got a bombard, a bunch of infantry, two thud guns, and these delightful Rough Riders with their close assault of three, which does a which can do a decent job against many of the orc units we've seen. So, uh, a couple of the orc units have a whole, like, steamroller mechanic where you think they're going to engage in close quarters combat, and then they just run right over the unit. Let's we'll stay away from bone chuckas and bone breakers, huh? And let's finally get this region. Yeah, I'm good. What the fuck are we looking at here? Okay. We have two separate... Wildly so. Objective points. Wide open terrain here. Let's see whether my foe has a punishment for me lurking near the edge of the map. Though, I'm not going to be doing that with a lot of units this mission, unlike last mission. I'll even have the artillery up as well. We're going to go after this point. It just makes the most sense. We have a bunch of difficult terrain around here. This map looks familiar, but I can't say for certain off the top of my head that we've seen it before. You see shadows behind every corner now. Yeah, so let's just put them there for now. Just put them in the fire. The Thud Guns. Planet Guard. Other Planet Guard. The Hellhounds. Got three of them. More Thud Guns. The Rough Riders. And more infantry. Okay, so the Rough Riders are going to be out here in the open. Not a great circumstance for me to be able to creep up on armor and break it. And not a great circumstance for me to be able to rush the infantry that's going to be here and break them as well. I don't have chimeras uh, due to Jimmy just not wanting to have chimeras anymore. I would rather have the thud guns of the chimeras. Yeah, I'm going to push on this point, and then I'm going to look to inflict enough casualties on the orcs that I win through morale score. That's just about right. Uh, who do I want to place up front? Probably the Hellhounds. I don't... I don't feel strong about having the Hellhounds in my group. In my party. Sir, and I might be a bad enough dude to... Put the thud Commissar. guns down here. Commissar. I should be leery of map edges, you know? I have things too close to map edges. Okay. Sir. 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 And I guess I'm Sir. also gonna group some shit up? Yeah, Commissar. sure. Commissar. There are some punishments for that. But not extensive. Sir. 
do I want to do this single file or do I want to double file the thud guns? I think I want to double file the thud guns. Yeah, I like that idea. Let's not go so wide out. Now, I could have the thud guns be a bit further north, I suppose. So that my infantry is not exposed. But on the flip side, it's the infantry, right? Come on, man. Okay. And then we've just got nine. Coming, we got a bunch of dudes with guns. Sir. Coming, sir. And we're just going to be out here making moves. Coming, sir. Sir. Yeah. I think I want the distance there. Just a little bit of separation. Gotta keep them separated. Now, do I want to do, like, three lines of five? I don't know how far north I want to spread out here. That makes sense to me. In fact... Zooming in will make this easier. Let's shuffle the kids up by one step. Yeah, and then... Instead of plugging that line in here, I've had it so that we're plugging in that line there. All right. Everyone just beautifully clumped up for area of effect death. I love it. That's uh, that's gaming right there. <laughs> that's 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 big gaming. Okay. I think we charge out with the Rough Riders through the Thug Guns, and then I have the Hellhounds down here. We'll put them like this. And this is to keep the units closer together, because I'm uncertain. Like, this is just very clearly my attack angle, and based on the mechanics of the game that I've seen so far, I'm not inclined to separate and have units isolated up here. And I haven't had a whole lot of punishment come my way for just turbo grouping everything up. Besides, I get to act first. Those are the rules of engagement. Okay. A bunch of bow burners. And cannon speedsters. Okay. We've seen those cannon speedsters in action against the Rough Riders. Fairly potent. And they've got that 28 range as well, which makes them dangerous for certain. Morale score is close together. I'm gonna move you guys up. We're gonna speed this up. And I am out of range of the cannon pieces, and I definitely consider those the bigger threat. With that in mind, I am here to take shots at so I guess I could... No, I can't shoot at the building. It's just a little too far. But there are definitely uh, single orcs in my area. Evil sons waiting to... Waiting to learn more. Waiting to vaporize me. Oh. Let's try that again. Commissar. 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 Sir. I'd have died of alcohol poisoning Commissar. if I chose to take a shot every time I heard that damn sound. I presume there are units over here that are just out of my line of sight. That's why I'm not double moving these thud guns. Presumably I'd want to have them in a better position to shoot. Do I really care if I lose them? Commissar. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. These are the questions of our Sir. times. 
Now always count on me to ask the tough questions. Okay. That way we can get them in a better position to shoot. Just admiring this terrain here. Especially that fire, that is. Gotta slow that fire down, man. <laughs> Okay, Hellhounds, you are a close quarters tank, range of five. Uh, you have no business being out here in the open against these cannon speeds does. There's no cover I can really use to creep up and shoot anything from this position. Uh, but I wouldn't have liked it if I positioned you up north and tried to get in here anyway. Uh, you are certainly a deterrent more for infantry, and that's just not present in front of us right now. So, uh, let's see if we can make a present. I don't think there's real value in saving your opportunity fire. It would mainly be so that I don't have you more exposed to danger in the shots. Yeah, that would be why I wouldn't send you so far ahead, so that you're not dying. But you know what? Every rose has its thorn. Just like every night has its dawn. <laughs> and rather than moving all these kids up as a group, I'm definitely moving them individually. Where does our where does our movement grid take us? Okay. I'm fine with that. And if bad things happen, eh. I've had more expensive units to replace. Now that I have so many uh, regions, I'm... I was gonna say that I'm a... I guess I still am saying that I'm willing to be a bit more cavalier. But I did cringe a little when I thought about that, considering the units I'm moving right now. My deepest apologies. I think the instruction manual uh, made mention in the special, like, effects of the cannon speedsters that they are unreliable, that the, uh, that the tank can break with usage. But I don't remember for certain, and of course, if I wanted to access that knowledge, uh, it would be crashing the video game. Speaking of uh, any potential things involving that, go ahead and save the fucker. It is certainly time consuming to move a bunch of these units. Particularly without uh you know moving them all together as a group. I uh I will profess as much. I think we're good. Alright, great. I end my turn. Highly accomplished, zero kill turn. Should probably roll the bombards up once and then shoot next turn, just so I can get more things in the range. I'm a little skittish about putting them in uh, a line of fire with all the armor. Um, it's a nice clump that I'm liable to hit multiple like tanks in that. That's what a few cannon speeds does. Is this point empty? I'm looking at all of the, uh, like, the resource cost I'm seeing up there. Is there fucking nothing? I didn't get shot at once down here. I didn't see a fucking thing move. Well, damn, if that don't beat all. Okay, let's go in the rest of the way.
face the hellhounds out like this. Uh, hellhounds and these infantry clumps against that. <laughs> or that. This is a a rough army comp to see here, I'll say. That's what I got. Okay. You have the same range as the cannon speeds does. Give me a visual comp here for a square base grid. How does that look? Okay. How many squares short is that? Okay. I'm thinking about, like, the infantry being up here, especially if it's so clumped together and how I saw the rate of fire work on those cannon speeds does. All right. Here's what we do. Move up like this. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. I might have the thud guns take point Commissar. here. Commissar. They have equal range. Sir. I'm just going to be rolling dice, and uh, I probably won't replace these losses. I'm not... Commissar. What am Sir. I? What do you think I'm in? The the mid game now? Sir. After after all these after all these conquests? I feel like I've gone past the early game. I feel like we can uh move past that. Yeah, I think I shoot in this area. Alright, cool. The cannon speeds are certainly more dangerous. Oh, you're just normal units. You just stopped being green. That was gorgeous. They're down to 480 now. That's just where the requisition went. <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, I uh, I don't think our, our happy fun charge times are, are going to be here with us. Unless I get surprised by a a whole heap of infantry coming around the bend, but I'm I feel pretty confident, given the the lack of vision blocking around here. I'd see that. Then again, I remember what happened to me with vision blocking last mission. I certainly made some mistakes last mission. I can't blame, Commissar. you know, Commissar. I walk away from Commissar. the Commissar. events that transpired Commissar. with some blame, you know? Commissar. I freely confess this. Yeah, I don't think this is a fight for you all, the, the infantry at all. Sir. Uh... Sir. I think I'm just gonna, like, scatter you all out? Commissar. Sir. You're just here to provide I'm extra sorry. morale score. <laughs> so I don't lose the fucking mission, I guess. I'll probably have them in trench next turn. Commissar. And you know, separate out more than what has happened here. Commissar. Commissar. Because at range of 20, I'd have to lock them up forward. A uh, pin of 40 versus a. You know, that's armor 58. Huh. Well, we still got time. Sir. We still got time. Commissar. 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 Nothing down here at the southern objective point. It's a choice. Of course, I still don't have control over the fucker. 
All right, that, that'll definitely do it. Hellhounds, I... You know, I tried to make use out of you today. I did. Honest engines. Just, just wasn't meant to be. And you all, I don't... I don't think so, man. I think, I think this is a job for the thud guns. And, uh... For the bombards. Okay. Oh, it's just... It's all so deliciously clumped. The cannon speeds is a more dangerous. Thomas. Sorry, I selected in incorrect order. Alright, that took care of that. 33% suppression now on that group. Cool. Let me get a uh, another visual indicator of your range. All right. So with their 16 move, they could go, say, 14, 12, 10, 8. All right. With that in mind... Sir. We're here to move up fully Sir. again. Thomas on. Commissar. This being a wide open Sir. area Sir. means Sir. that, Commissar. Commissar. well, you know, Commissar. Sir. Sir. no cover. We got to charge across to get each other. And as the in the manual, the user manual instructs me, the Imperium of Man's advantage is an artillery. Commissar. Commissar. So I'm just gonna be out here doing uh Sir. doing thud guns. Which Sir. you know Sir. Sir. Not flawless. Sir. The cannon species do have the same ranges. Sir. Losses will be sustained. Alright. Now next turn. Sir. We uh just a trench and just let it just let it fly. Thomas Whatever Thomas. happens, happens. Sure, roll off the map. That works for me. They're down to 335 in score. I have concerns this mission will be dull. <laughs> okay, we got some Balburnas coming up there from the north. Alright. This block line aside or is that just impassable terrain for you? Let me see that. That 100% block shots. Okay. That's good to know. Thomas up. Hmm. Okay. I think I continue to not entrench with everyone then. Thomas up. Thomas Let's get into a position where Thomas we're going to be super clumped up for these Thomas damn Balburnas, but I want to be in a spot where I can take shots. As they come Thomas to eat me alive. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I suppose I do have a total of 15. Yeah. Sir. Thomas up. Right. Thomas up. Let's get digging. Sir. Killing me here. Thank you. Okay, cool. Yeah, no actions with you all. The enemy is too far. Okay. Commissar. How we looking here, chum? It looks like uh, they could move once and shoot me twice. Let's not move up then. They are speedier, so they can definitely outmaneuver my blood guns.
Okay. So I want to get him positioned then where I can reaction fire. Commissar. And hopefully prevail. So I think this is the line I choose. Now I suppose they could just move up once and then shoot that infantry. Eh. Is there the position I chose? I didn't move them further back. Well, if it happens, it happens. They knew what they signed up for. <laughs> okay. Commissar. 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 Sir. Commissar. Commissar. Sir. Sir. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. Sir. All right, let's get some bodies up there. Start taking some hits. The little thud guns that could with their 40 pin. Eh, roll some dice, man. Here comes the infantry. Multiple Balburnas coming in from the north. That is not the maneuvering I expected. Why the fuck wouldn't you move and shoot? Why would you just move and not shoot? I... I don't understand. Commissar. Why? I mean, yeah, sure, okay. Commissar. You... You craftily and sneakily moved back out of my fucking attack range. The AI certainly does that a lot. But the thud gun, so... Cool. That way you can get two shots off. I guess? Um, sure? Commissar. Commissar. Just here to roll some dice, Sir. man. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. Sir. Commissar. There will be many losses. That's why I figured they needed to oppress their attack, you know? Because it's only a matter of time until I roll the hits with the artillery. You gotta, you gotta come get me. That's, that's the game design, bro. You gotta come get me. I'm not the one who designed it so that the defender has to come get the attacker. Player one's always the attacker. That's, that's what's stipulated. You're the defender, but... Defensive advantages are not something you are in abundance of. You don't have any cool, like, custom cannon turrets that you captured and or built from scrap to attack me as I try to kill you, forcing me to, like, do something else. Now I'm going to getting into game design because I'm annoyed at the, the map. And just thoughts that I've just been... Using over, just spilling out. Boop. Commissar. Commissar. I mean, I'll do it. I'll fucking roll dice. Good work, Thud Gun. Commissar. You're having to charge with flamethrowers. That sucks. Commissar. Commissar. I, I feel your pain. Commissar. Why the fuck were no enemy units deployed back there? Damnedest thing. They've got what, two more turns? 
to do something? Anything? Come as up. Spirit us away. Country roads. Where the fuck are you going? <laughs> Take me home. Okay. To the place I belong, Volstead, Holy Terror, take me home. See, I thought I was picking the fun regiment with this with this attack. <laughs> so. So fucking annoyed. <laughs> I'm so fucking annoyed. <laughs> I, what are you doing? Your orcs. Your fucking orcs. I'm supposed to look at the bizarre fucking contraptions you got and go, oh god! Then you fucking <laughs> throw them at me! And I sustain casualties! Do you not understand how the 41st millennium works? <laughs> how do I have zero deaths? <laughs> zero! My game design thoughts that I really thought I was going to be filing away for over just really are, like, threatening to spill out right now. Like, the game design works better if I'm the orcs and I'm assailing the planet of Volastad to capture it. You want to know why? Because then my opponent would be uh, some varying regulars and irregulars of the Imperium of Man, who has artillery! And like fortified embankments and like fucking cannons and shit that would reach across the map and force me to take action. You know, the, the whole assault on the spaceport, that was, you know, that was back in like mission two. Like, yeah, I gotta run out there into the open and take the spaceport. I gotta go do that. Could we not deviate from the epic board game to, oh, I don't know, give the orcs in the single player cannon some fucking reach? <laughs> You're like, Grimoth, they're orcs. Like, look at how, like, lore, like, sensitive, like the user manual is with all the detail. Right, they're orcs. So they should charge me! Really testing out the software compressor <laughs> that I've recently enabled. It's a... Come at me, bro! <laughs> what the fuck? Well, Commander, I have something you should see. This is Sergeant Matthias of the Mordian Iron Guard. We are currently over the Methuselah Quadrant of Hive City, Polvania's external factory plateau. I've been observing a great deal of Orc Mech Boy activity at this location. I thought it best you knew at once. I fear the Orcs may have discovered the factory site belonging to the Volistad Ironlands. In Orc hands, it could supply them with tanks beyond number. If we act now and recapture them, have an invaluable asset. The audio balancing on these SM FMVs have also, like, been wild. The intro one was strong. All of the others until that one have been sucky. That one wasn't too bad. Okay. So that is, that is a, that is a directive. Neat. I want tanks. I don't want them to have tanks. Not that they would attack with the fucking tanks, you know. 
They just circle jerk with the fucking tanks. Oh, let's form a wagon caravan like we're going to Oregon, everyone. That's that'll that'll help protect us against the the vicious mean old Imperium. No. <laughs> Like, just, you gotta have some with a range longer than 28. You gotta, you gotta give me a little bit more pep on my step here, man. This can't keep happening, can it? All right, speaking of canning it, I'm gonna, I'm gonna reserve, like, the rest of the thoughts that have been brewing uh, for the nebulous time period known as the future, because I really do want to dig into game design and how I feel about the single-player campaign, how I feel broadly about the game as a whole, because those are separate feelings. Uh, but uh, we're going to do that in another video. Next time, we've got a good old Regiment 1 that's going to be attacking Carpathia? Carpathia. Its wastes have always been home to vile creatures. The orcs are only the worst. Uh, that way I can get them into position next turn to liberate the tank factories. Uh, I will get another regiment from here. Uh, I don't remember what its composition is or what the reference card says, uh, but these regiments will most certainly be out of position to attack orcs. I'm going to have to spend several turns walking them to front lines. I'm uh, pretty interested, though, in what I get from here. Again, though, future times.